बर्थ वेट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट इज दी एवरेज बर्थ वेट इन इंडिया These are all one word answers from older FMG papers. Okay, I am hearing or looking at two three different answers. Some are saying two point five kg, some are saying two point eight, some are saying three kg, some are saying four kg. It is two point eight kilogram. See, please be careful. You cannot mark two point five kg because if you mark two point five kg, what it will mean? Almost everyone is low birth weight in the country at the time of birth, which is not possible. Birth weight doubles by birth weight triples by two questions of FMG paper. Birth weight doubles by birth weight triples by. What answer should I write? Doubles by. Some are saying five months. Some are saying six months. It doubles by five months. triples by 1 year of age what they have not asked it quadruples by 2 years of age it quadruples by 2 years of age but these two have been asked in our paper birth weight must be measured within how much time of delivery measured within how much time of delivery See, ideally, it should be measured as soon as possible, half an hour, one hour. But there has to be some outer limit. They are asking within outer limit. Suppose it is a home delivery. Medical officer comes to know that delivery has taken place in his catchment area after six hours. How will he measure as soon as possible? So maximum within twenty-four hours. Now, friends, I am looking at. I am looking at. one of the technical questions which you need to understand from pediatric try to understand this concept now suppose they will make a very lengthy question they will make a very lengthy question for you how you are medical officer of a phc you come to know after two days that there was a delivery in your catchment area in one of the homes that delivery was conducted by trained dai who was not aware that she has to take the birth weight of the newborn now two days are passed when you reach the house of the mother how will you now measure the birth weight of the child it was not recorded within 24 hours this was the question how will you record birth weight if it has not been recorded within 24 hours friends this is a concept of pediatrics see birth weight we are looking at let us say day 0 or day 1 what happens after first day of life weight will increase decrease or remain same yes it will decrease it decreases up till what time it decreases up till what day it decreases till day 7 and if proper breastfeeding is done after birth it will keep on increasing continuously thereafter indicating the nutritional status is good so there will be a time when child will again attain weight almost equal to birth weight which is this time this was the question this is day 10 so try to listen to what i am telling you ideally birth weight should be recorded within first 24 hours due to some reason it was not recorded then you can record the weight of the newborn on 10th day of life and we will make a presumption that this will be approximately equal to the birth weight second question birth weight what is the field instrument how do you record birth weight of a newborn in your hospitals you have got digital electronic weighing scales but not in a village setting it is salter scale salter scale is like a spring balance so what we do we put the newborn in a sling and measure the weight of a newborn like a shopkeeper does right so it is a spring balance based weight measurement of the newborn salter scale because its image based question has been asked in the exam now these pink color underlines are the questions asked in fmg exam till now let us move further what is next popular question of your paper what is low birth weight in the country 
I think this is the most popular question from this weight topic. What is the cutoff for low birth weight in India? Less than 2.5 kg. Now I am giving you an applied question. Suppose they'll make again a very lengthy question. You are medical officer of a PHC. A delivery was planned at your health center. But mother, you had preterm delivery. Labor pains were preterm. And child was born at 28 weeks period of gestation. What will be the low birth weight cut off now at 28 weeks period of gestation? What will be the cut off for low birth weight at 28 weeks period of gestation? Answer is it will remain same. So friends, this is the concept you have to remember. Low birth weight cut off does not depend on gestational age of the newborn. Low birth weight cut off does not depend on gestational age of the newborn. I'll repeat. Whether a child is born at 20 weeks period of gestation, 28, 30, 34, 36, 40, 42, 44. Do not look at period of gestation when you are diagnosing low birth weight. Only measure weight on the day of delivery. Right, Dr. Kumar? So, only measure weight on the day of delivery. If it is less than 2.5, directly make a diagnosis on the case sheet that this is a low birth weight child. So, low birth weight does not depend on POG, that is period of gestation. Low birth weight does not depend on period of gestation. Whether it is preterm, term delivery, postterm delivery, less than 2.5 kg will always be called as low birth weight. In your exam, WHO classification of low birth weight has been asked. What is moderately low birth weight, very low birth weight, extremely low birth weight? When I look at your FMG paper, very low birth weight and extremely low birth weight cutoff has been asked. So friends, you tell me now, it is in a sequence, moderately low birth weight, less than 2 kg. This has not been asked in your paper. What has been asked, very low birth weight is less than 1.5 kg. Extremely low birth weight less than 1 kg. Extremely low birth weight is less than 1 kg. Now friends, pink underlines, again I will remind you, just for your ease, so that you are able to identify the questions of FMG, I am underlining all the questions of your exam. So we will discuss a lot of things. But focus on your exam questions. Let's come to the next question. Many years ago, in your exam, they asked, what is the prevalence of low birth weight in India? What is the prevalence of low birth weight in India? See, when this question came in your exam, FMG, around 10 years ago, at that time, answer was 28%. But of course, in 10 years, a lot of things have changed. So now you have to mark the latest answer, 18.7%. Or you can say 18% is enough. That means roughly one out of every five births in India today is low birth weight. One out of every five is low birth weight. Friends, another technical question. They, again, you will have to integrate the concept of low birth weight with the concept of pediatrics low birth weight. Let's look at that. Now there was a question in your exam few years ago. What is preterm delivery? What is term delivery? What is postterm delivery? So let's write here. Preterm delivery, term delivery, postterm delivery. We are talking in terms of period of gestation. Dr. Rupal, you are absolutely right. Preterm is less than 37 weeks period of gestation. What is term delivery? Very right, Dr. Babuji. This is 37 to 42 weeks period of gestation. And postterm logically will be more than 42 weeks period of gestation. So first you memorize this. Even in OBS, Gaini, they cannot give you another answer because this is followed throughout the India. PHC, CHC, medical college, government, private sector, corporate hospital, private clinic. Everywhere cutoff is seen. Now try to listen carefully when I tell you the next level of question. Now, when 
it is a preterm delivery suppose mother has started developing labor pains let's say 28 weeks period of gestation 30 weeks period of gestation so we tell the mother you are going to have a preterm delivery that is a very high chance the child born will be low birth weight average birth weight in india is already 2.8 and you are having preterm delivery also high chances child born will be low birth weight so when it is a preterm delivery and it is low birth weight we actually are not surprised we know it was going to happen in fact we tell the mother before that most likely newborn will be low birth weight but if it is a term delivery it is a post term delivery we expect child should have normal weight or slightly higher than normal weight but sometimes even these children may turn out to be low birth weight popular question of your exam what is this known as dr pushpendra is right dr rupal is right this is known as small for date also known as small for gestational age i'll repeat small for 37 38 39 40 42 the moment it crosses 42 it becomes postum so i'll again repeat preterm low birth weight was expected it is not a cause of surprise but if it is a term or a postum delivery and still low birth weight that is a cause of surprise and that is known as small for date small for gestational age newborns small for date small for gestational age newborns its technical definition is less than 10th percentile weight for gestational age and second answer many have already written in the chat box already what is the most common cause of small for date small for gestational age in india yes dr nikita you are right it is iugr so please remember these are the questions which are asked from low birth weight or birth weight topic in our exam this we have to definitely definitely remember 